Hey everybody! Today I'm going to be drawing Katie! So let's get started. Okay, so this is the last portrait I'm doing in the whole preparation for VidCon in case I meet them people series. <laughs> but um, by the time this is going up, I will be at VidCon and hopefully having a good time. <laughs> And this video I'm drawing Katie Morton, and if you do not know her, I highly, 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 highly recommend checking her out. I'll put a link in the description below to her YouTube, Twitter, and Patreon page if you want to uh, support her. She does. She's a, a licensed therapist, and all her videos talk about mental health, depression, um, anxiety, and uh, eating disorders. There's a lot of stuff on there that she talks about. And it's a whole variety of things. I'm sure you'll find something that you're interested in. And I actually found out about her through Hank Green fairly recently. And I say fairly recently kind of in quotes because, you know, in internet time, like a week ago is like 20 years ago. <laughs> but I found her uh, through Hank many months ago. I don't actually remember when I first uh, found her. I think he was like when he was doing a whole recommend people on he had like a video where he recommended a bunch of youtubers and maybe he collabed with her now i can't even remember but anyway it doesn't matter i found her channel i started watching her stuff and in general mental health is like a massive deal to me and it's something that i really care about and i really wished that you know we didn't have such stigma or misunderstandings or just lack of even listening with mental health and like there are people out there who don't even think that like mental health is like a thing <laughs> and it just boggles my mind and I don't want to get into politics here but anyway if you're you know going through some hard times or just something or maybe you're just interested interested in the topic or maybe you just want to I don't know, venture out into something that you never really thought to look into. Like, I definitely recommend her channel. You are pretty much guaranteed to find at least one video that you'd be like, hmm, what's that? And then just <laughs> watch it. Or, I don't know. Because, like, even on videos where I may not completely relate to, or, I don't know, just sometimes, I just learn so much. And it's really nice to learn things that I either didn't know or just learn more about something and um, I really really love her videos with Tomska um, those just I also <laughs> I also really like Tomska too so there's a little bit of bias there but they do really work uh, well together so whenever they collab I get excited but even by herself her videos are great and she just it's so calm and relaxing to watch her videos like she keeps her voice is so soft and soothing, so it can just really calm you down even to just listen to her, which is great. And I just really appreciate her talking about mental health in general and just getting that information out there and saying that, yeah, this is a thing that exists. And not only that, but if you have some things, like here are some things that could help you. And it's even in like everyday life. So even if you don't have certain afflictions, she has videos that can apply to pretty much everybody. Like just ways to make your days better, better ways to make you happier. Like there's even like really kind of, I don't want to say the word basic exactly, but kind of basic like that. And general, I guess that's, that's the better word, <laughs> general. And I feel like she's just bringing light to issues that are never really touched on and that are important and that are real and that means a lot to me, like, in general. I feel like I'm kind of repeating myself going in circles here, but I don't know. She just seems like a really calm, nice person who, like, again, like I mentioned in, I think, Phil's video, where, like, you can only know somebody so much through their videos. So, obviously, like, I don't know her personally, but just from what I'm gathering from her videos, she just seems really open-minded and... Uh, trusting, trustworthy. She seems like just a generally really nice, caring person. Like this is something she's really passionate about and she really wants to make a difference and she really wants to help people. And yeah, so that I really appreciate and I really look up to people who are able to do things like that for others. And 
like she even mentioned this in one of her videos that I watched recently. Like not everybody is going to be able to help everyone. You know, sometimes you just got to help yourself and just in general, like go look at her channel and go watch a bunch of her videos because there are a lot of great topics, a lot of great advice, and you are pretty much guaranteed to learn something new. And um, yeah, so Katie, if you're watching this, hi, I really love your channel and the videos and just the things you do. And it means a lot to somebody who has their own afflictions to see somebody talking positively and trying to help others in the mental health community. So thumbs up for me and um, hopefully I'm able to see you at VidCon, but you know, no big deal if not. Uh, hopefully you like the drawing anyway. <laughs> and um, I guess just to talk a little bit about the portraits, it was actually really fun to do some pinks. I feel like I don't have enough pink in my art. Like I, I rarely use the color pink. And as I was looking for reference photos to use to draw her, I was finding some that I was liking, but nothing really kind of popped out as being like, oh, that's the picture. And also a lot of the pictures as with Jackson Aaron's <laughs> pictures, um, low resolution. So it was kind of difficult to find ones to even try and work with. I mean, to no fault of hers. But um, I ended up going with the staple picture that she has on her channel and for her icon. And because it's like, you know, why not? That's <laughs> anyway. And plus it's pink. Like I was like, I, I never use pink, even with my uh, markers and stuff. Like I never use pink and I feel really bad because <laughs> it's like, oh, I should be using pink. Why not? It's a fun color. So that was really fun to do, to mix up some pinks and, um, I really love how her shirt came out. I'm actually really proud of that shirt. <laughs> Just the folds look really nice. <laughs> and uh, it was fun to do curly hair because um, I don't really get to do that often. And well, her hair's not like super curly. It's like loose, curly, wavy. But um, that was still kind of fun to draw just because it feels like not very often I get to do that. And I really need to draw curly hair more often and just in general hair more often. <laughs> But this was uh, fun to do. And it's the last one. It's the last one, you know, until eventually in the future. I'm sure I'll draw more YouTubers, no doubt. This was just uh, shoving in as many as I could before VidCon. And I did it. I did it. Oh, that was six paintings. That was a lot of work. But it was fun and rewarding. And I hope that everybody watching enjoyed it. And I hope all the YouTubers I drew, if they ended up stumbling upon it somehow, or if I end up giving it to them, like hopefully they liked it. Uh, no big deal. If not, I understand. <laughs> but yeah, so that's the end of this. And if you guys are at VidCon, since it's going on uh, as when this video comes up, not when I'm recording, but it will be when you watch this video. But if you're, you're there and you want to try and find me and say hi, uh, feel free to hit me up on Twitter. Uh, link is in the description to my account. It's just at Sam Be Awesome. And we'll see if we can try and meet up or something and just say hi. But uh, I guess that's it for this one. Again, links in the description to her YouTube, Twitter, and Patreon are all in the description. Please go check her out. She is amazing and it's definitely, definitely worth your time to just even watch one of them. And yeah, so <laughs> thank you again, Katie, for what you do. And thanks for watching. Out of all the YouTubers I've done, she has the easiest intro to do. <laughs> she wears a lot of cute shirts and I don't really have that many cute clothes, but I wore one and it like doesn't even show up on the frame. Like, wore a cute shirt and doesn't show up on camera. <laughs>